What's up guys, Vern here, Pokeboy Productions. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing for you guys today. This is something related to basketball. I've been looking for a cameraman kind of thing, like a gimbal that follows you. A lot of the brands out there are pretty pricey and expensive. This one is not bad for the price and it's budget friendly, so we'll check it out. But first we'll unbox it, so keep watching. All right, as you can tell, it's already open because nosy me wanted to see what's inside. Get rid of this paper here. Uh, this is the tripod T1. Oh, it comes with a tripod, it's cool. And a no frills box for what's inside. So let's check out what we got inside. First, we'll open the tripod. This is called the Xbot Go for those of you who don't know. It's made in China, branded right there. And um, Blink Tech Inc. Um, yeah, let's open it. Granted, I do have a lot of tripods, but this one, if you don't have one, it's good to package it with your gimbal, your automatic gimbal, supposedly. See what's in here comes in a nice little carrying case xbot go www.blinktech.inc yep all right and then you just open it and here you go another tripod to add to my collection now I know you could get a bigger, longer one. It's part of the options, but I wanted to save as much money as I can because I already have plenty of tripods, like I said. But this looks good enough. It's sturdy. And um, I think, yeah, you can extend the legs. So that's good. So I will most definitely use this tomorrow, this tripod, and see how it handles. Um, yeah, okay, let's open the, the main event box. That's what you all came in here for. Let's see if there's anything to open with this here. Um, oh, okay. You just ripped this open right here. Unfortunately, it's breaking up on me. Okay, there you go. Oh, this one's a tough one. Okay, there you go. All right, here we go. Again, it says made in China. So this is a Chinese brand. A little tough to open, hold on. It's gonna go th thousand years later. <laughs> All right, here we go. Xbot Go AI Cameraman. Nice little box. Smart AI tracking, sport tracking gimbal. It auto tracks and records games via free Xbox Go app, which I've already downloaded on my phone. Free live streaming via Facebook, YouTube, and more. Free cloud-based storage. That's awesome. No subscription or hidden fee. That's one of the things that got me interested in this is because of the subscription because a lot of the cameras out there right now, very, very pricey. And some of them even come with subscription-based and I'm just playing basketball for fun. So nothing to, I don't need to go too deep into it. I just need some, someone to, or something to, to record my games while I'm playing, right? Um, it says, says sports, basketball, soccer, and more. So if you have kids that like to play sports, this might be a good option for you guys. And the uh, app does update monthly, it says. So I'm assuming they're gonna keep fixing things. You know, if it's not perfect now, which I'm assuming it's not, you know for the price that you get but we'll check it out and uh, we'll test it out tomorrow but uh okay let's open this box i've talked enough let me just rip open this tape here <clears throat> so um i actually saw this on uh facebook i guess it was 
snooping around Google, was checking out what I'm interested in, and was looking at gimbals and whatnot. So this popped up, and I decided to give it a go. And I, I've seen a couple of YouTube reviews about it, so figure I'll give it a try. So they do have inside the box is an instructions right there. Um, looks simple enough. And then if you don't need to read the box here, you have an actual instruction manual here. I'll probably read through this pretty no frills and looks simple enough like I said it does come with its own uh, little bag to carry your gimbal in and of course here is the x -Watt go gimbal I'm hoping it will fit my camera <laughs> I have the galaxy fold so we'll see how it goes fingers crossed it works if not might have to return it but you know we'll see and there's something else in here and that is oh okay so if you don't want to use this gimbal I mean this uh, tripod you have the option of using this to stand it just like that pretty cool all right so I like what I'm getting but um like I said, we'll test this out. I'm going to download the app on my phone. I'm going to make sure my phone actually fits in this gimbal before I uh, test it out tomorrow when I play basketball. And then uh, you'll see the final results here. Good, bad, or otherwise, you'll see everything here. All right, guys. Let's go. All right, guys, set up. Just taping this game. Looks like it's working. It's following. That's awesome. Don't know how well it's going though. But I'm gonna record my game, I'm just gonna stop it. So anyway guys, as you can see, I got a new phone, the Galaxy S24 Ultra, my Galaxy Fold 4 or 5, you went kaput, it 
didn't work and I'm glad that Samsung took in this trade for this brand new Ultra Fidelity phone. This is awesome actually, I love this phone. So anyway, it worked perfectly because now I got the Xbox Go and as you can see, we did a lot of testing with it. Um, so yeah, I believe this is a really good product. In fact, I even have the remote control. I bought this. I haven't used it yet, but uh, let's put it to the test and see how it works. So to get started, this actually shows you where you're supposed to put it, the direction the phone is supposed to go in. So this is just an easy, just like that. I believe you could use this as a gimbal if you want, but I've not done so because I've used this for more, more so for sports, for tracking, for basketball. Uh, let's just uh, get this started. So this is how it should start, right? It should be, you know, in a horizontal, horizontal view. Right? Is it hard? No, ver vertical, sorry. It should be in vertical view. And then if you, uh, I already got the app installed. So you see how it looks like in camera. And, uh, and if you just want to flip it to the correct angle that you want, there you go. So now it's set up to record. We're just going to place it on this tripod, which is an easy screw right here. Just like that, easy setup. In fact, uh, you can move it around by the joystick. And there you go. I'll have it face to you guys. And here's the controller. I think this is set up already, but if not, I wanna turn this on. Okay, keep control like this, look. Granted, I haven't used this yet. I haven't used this through manual mode because I was relying on the AI aspects of the gimbal. And for the most part, it did its job, especially if it's far away. So I tried it in two different basketball courts. One was this school that I go to, my ex high school. And it followed this for the most part. It kind of got confused when people got into the court, but I was impressed because, you know, it followed the ball for the most part but it did get confused once in a while but you know for uh ai gimbal that's not too expensive i think that that was pretty good it didn't fare too well with the other court that i play in that was a little closer and i think it got even more confused and it really didn't focus too much on the game maybe if i zoomed out a little bit more if it was a league game where it's just a referee and the game itself i don't think it would get lost that much so i have to put that on the test but as you can see that's how you do it. it will work so anyway yeah so this is the xbot gimbal xbot go gimbal i think you use this as a gimbal like i said so you carry it around it's very stable but uh for the most part i'm going to use it for sports for activities to record games and uh we'll see how it goes i know they do have a kickstarter out it's for the new xbot go i don't remember what the name is but for the makers of Xbox Go, if you're willing to give me a chance to review a product, you know how to reach me. <laughs> so yeah, I'll leave all the information down below to see, show you the price. Make sure you guys download the app. Everything is pretty easy to set up. And uh, yeah, I'm impressed. I like it for the price. And uh, we'll see where it goes from here. I know the team is always working on improving the follow me, follow me mode. So, uh, and then the new product that's coming out in Kickstarter, I have high hopes for that. So we'll see where it goes. So yeah, everything down below if you're interested. So anyway guys, thanks for watching. If this is your first time here, make sure you subscribe down below, hit that red button, ring that bell so you get notified of all our future videos. Like, comment, and share, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks guys.